Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. On today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to connect your Instagram account to your actual Facebook business page. Now, this was a requested video that someone asked me to make um, this morning, and I wanted to go ahead and do it since it's a short video. Now, the reason why you want to connect your Instagram to your actual Facebook business page is because if you want to start promoting Instagram ads, you need to have them connected, and that's the only way you'll be able to do so. So it's going to be a very simple step, so make sure that you watch all the way to the end. Now, if this is your first time visiting my YouTube channel and you want to grow an impactful online business, don't forget to subscribe to my channel today. I do upload weekly videos to help you. Don't forget to show me some love by liking this video. And don't forget, if you have any questions about additional videos you would like me to create, leave a comment below. So let's go ahead and dive in. This is going to be a very quick video. So the first thing you need in order to connect your Instagram and your Facebook is an actual Facebook business page. So not your profile, but an actual business page that you have. So make sure that you set that up first. The second step is all you will need to do is pretty much is click on settings on your actual business page. And from here, it's going to have different options. You're going to go down to Instagram. And from here, it's going to tell you to connect your Instagram account. Now, the only thing you need is your username and your password. I actually have second verification set up on my Instagram account. So it's going to ask me to put in a special code. If you have that, then you do that as well. If you don't have that, you don't need to do any additional steps. I do recommend when you have a second to set up your Instagram account to have a verification code, which means that if somebody was to hack into your account and they wanted to change the password, they would not be able to because this specific code is going to be sent to your text prior to doing the change. And that's just a second verification to make sure no one hacks your account. It's a really great way to keep your account secure, take it from someone that has been hacked a couple times. So Let's go ahead and do so. So I'm going to connect my account. Um, I'm going to put my username or my, which is my handle name. So you will put your handle name and then I'm going to type in my password. And from here it's going to send my phone number, a specific code that I need to put in. So I'm going to put that right now. I just got it. So bear with me for a few seconds. And then I'm going to confirm. Now, once you are log, logged in and you connected your Instagram to your Facebook, um, you wait a few seconds. Sometimes you will have to refresh the page. If not, it will automatically do it itself. And voila. So right now, my account is connected to my Facebook business page. And that's all you have to do. And then when you run a Facebook ad, when you are doing your ad, um, on the very end, it's going to ask you the placements, where you want to show your ads. You could actually select whether you want to show them on Facebook and Instagram, or do you want to just do an Instagram campaign only? Or if you do, let's say you were in your Instagram, and sometimes you get that little button that says promote. If you click there, because you had them sync, you could automatically create an ad from your actual phone. I recommend doing it from the back end of business using Business Manager only because you're able to do more um, demographics, you're able to um, select interests, and it gives you more options from, your, from that end than it does actually doing it directly from Instagram. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, leave them below. And thank you guys again for watching.